Well, guys, we have it. Titan skating finally will be removed from Destiny 2 coming March. But what impact will lack of Titan skating have on the PC scene? First off, guys, I just want to say, I've got some throwaway gameplay in the background there, so enjoy that with your eyeballs. Yeah, for me, the first thing that the removal of Titans game gives is that I'm just not so worried about One-Eyed Mask anymore. The reason I'm not so worried about One-Eyed Mask anymore is because no longer are you going to have a Titan flying at you at max speed, shotgun in the hand, you tapping them once, they one-shotting you with their shotty, and then bang, he's got an overshield. And before you know it, he's running at the rest of your fucking team, overshield up. And obviously I'll get into it later, but I just think it, as the class of the whole of the Titan, they're now going to be so much more weaker. Because the trade-off you got of the Titan, right, was always the fact of movement speed wasn't the greatest, but you got all this utility, you got suppressor nades, you got very strong supers that are, can change depending on the situation, for instance, in Sentinel, using it as the Roman super just going around where you're chucking your frisbee shields about and that, in and in of itself is very strong now and then on the other side you got the where you can use it as a bubble to protect a point to guarantee heavy stuff like that what about the comp playlist what does that mean i think it's gonna be huge on pc absolutely fucking huge because no longer are you going to see the four stacks of titans with their run-eyed masks absolutely just flying into you and just destroying your team because they can just move around the map and get to joke points faster than you rip around use the four stack of titans also let's not forget that skating is just fun to do and that is a huge one for me personally yes i titan skate but not even in pvp as well just in pve just to be able to fly around at titan skating and just blast through this boring grind that everyone's done a million times like doing the same old strikes doing the same old daily heroic story missions you know with the titan skating you can just go whoop max speed Clear out that level and get onto something you actually want to do, get onto grinding quick play, grinding previous skill, grinding glory rank. Also the thing I'm worried about now is if they do nerf one eyed mask as well without skating, where is that gonna leave Titans? Like don't get me wrong, I don't think they're complete trash, but that's their two biggest plus sides at the minute, you know? Having this crazy, crazy good exotic and then the skating to be able to get to the point quicker than everyone else. So we'll see. Don't get me wrong, they still have their advantages. They've still got the suppressor nades, as I was saying earlier. They've got the strong supers. The shields as well, the class ability. I can literally block off a choke point and force the whole team to have to go another route. You know what to say, because I haven't mentioned tournaments at all in this. I'd, it's, it's not going to get affected because the way tournaments run, they just already banned macros and Titan skating, so it's, it's going to be the same old for there. But yeah, I mean, what do you think, guys? Please let me know in the comments. Are you worried? Are you happy? How do you think Titans are going to fit now in the new meta on PC come in March once the Titans game's gone? Please do let me know. But yeah, that does it for our quick thoughts video on the removal of Titans game come in March. Uh, overall, I think it's positive. It, it leaves some question marks for the Titan class as how they stand at the minute, especially, especially if One-Eyed Mask does eventually get nerfed as well. But time will tell, guys. I think for PvP in general, it's going to be better. It's going to be a more fun experience for everyone. Like, every way. <laughs> Less Titan apes, the better, in my opinion.